Jesus, Michael, you look like a bum. Put something nice on. You're wasting my time. Ah. Uh, let me know if you need help. That'll look great on you. Enjoy your purchase. the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. No, oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see, either we... The jewelers is on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they, uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. No, well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Townley. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Hey, what's going on, brother? Go on, man. You reading me? Mm-hmm. 
Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. I know. I mean, he can pay my rent, my car, my cards, but like, this is meant to be my thing. Sir, thank you. The alarm, the vents, and the cameras, come on! Glasses are live, shoot away. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Alright, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. Come on, we need a shot of the alarm console. The keypad and we're done. All I need is a shot of the alarm keypad. Come on, we need a shot of the alarm console. What do we got? A security camera and the alarm system. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Notes in my past. Bye, sweetie. Sorry if I was like purging and stuff. Bye. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. There, some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. I kept tabs on him for a while, needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there.
Let's speed this up. We don't want to draw attention. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told them to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window so when talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register, so I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. Uh, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Uh, well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinet. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door, or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Eddie Cho. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris. <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. Great. I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. 